Hi everyone, and welcome to this video where I'll show you how to make a navigation bar using VBA. A navigation bar can really increase the user friendliness of an Excel workbook, especially if the intended user is not very confident with Excel. Equally, it increases efficiency. Instead of having to drag your mouse to the bottom left to select the sheets, you can simply select each icon and automatically enter the right sheet. For example, if we click on the chart icon, we move into the analysis sheet, whereas if we click on the settings icon, we move into the settings sheet. The key, as you may have noticed, is to ensure that the icons are placed in the same position in each sheet. This makes the whole process look much more seamless and smooth. Moreover, it makes the navigation bar easier to use, as the user knows that in each sheet, the navigation bar is found in the same position. What we want to do in this video is create a set of macros which will automatically bring the user to the home page when they click the home icon, the analysis sheet when they click the chart icon, and the settings sheet when they click the settings icon. So let's remove the current code and let's get started by entering our VBA editor. The first thing you'll need to do is insert a module which we've done already. Next, we can start by creating our home navigation macro which we'll call home nav. Upon clicking the macro, we want the home sheet to be selected and we also want cell B5 to be selected for presentation purposes as it's a neutral cell. Therefore, we can enter the following lines. To prevent the screen from flashing when the code is executed, we're going to wrap application screen updating around the code. To replicate the code for the settings and analysis sheets, all we need to do is copy paste the code for the home nav macro and instead of selecting the home sheets within the code, change it to the setting sheets and the analysis sheet respectively. Next, let's assign the macros to the shapes. I'll demonstrate how to do this for the home sheets. So all you need to do is right click the shape, click assign macro, and then select home nav for the home icon. For the charts icon, we're going to select analysis nav. And for the settings icon, we're going to select settings nav. Let's now test the code out. Let's go into the setting sheets. Then let's go back into the home sheets. Let's now go into the analysis sheets by clicking the charts icon. And let's go back home. And then if we click the home icon, it of course keeps us in the same sheet. Now, if you want to make it even more intuitive, then it'll be worth assigning the macros in each sheet. However, for demonstration purposes, we've just assigned them to the home sheet. It's also worth noting that you can use any shapes to create your navigation bar. All you need to do is select the right sheets within your code and then assign the macro to the respective shape. This brings us to the end of this video. Please give it a thumbs up if you found it useful 
and subscribe to the Excel Hub for weekly Excel tutorials, techniques and examples.